Hello, this is Macy again. Welcome back to Code to Create. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to set up the connect with your computers. And there are three things you actually need. One, it's the Unity software. On the Microsoft side, they say you have to get a pro version of Unity. Actually, I test it out with just regular version. It works fine. The second one is a PC that has a special USB, which is USB 3.0. And the third it's item. It's the most important piece you actually need <laughs> to making things for Connect. It's this giant box. Actually, it took me a little while to find it in the Microsoft store. You can definitely find it on their online store. However, it takes a couple of days to ship. And the quickest way to grab it is actually just go to the Microsoft store nearby. Interesting enough is the people who work there and actually don't know what the thing was. Uh, took me half an hour. One of the staff there told me they don't have it. Another one said they have it, but it was a special connect for developers. I think they got really confused, same as I was, because this box was really big and um, it almost looked like a, like a connect. So probably the safest way for you to find it is just take a picture of this and show it to the store staff. They probably, oh, you know, I have seen this at our back shelf somewhere. So. That's it, and I will show you step by step how to set it up on your computers. Let's get started. So now I have all the cables and devices here. So this is the Connect Developer Cable. It comes with two parts. This is the power adapter. Here is the part that connects to the Connect 2. You can see this cable actually it's connected with the Connect, and it cannot be removed. The output it's this square edge plug and which we need to plug into uh, this connect adapters. And so this is the power plug, we need to plug it in. And uh, on the adapter side, there's another USB 3.0 plug. It only works with USB 3.0, so please make sure your computer has this component. So let's hook up everything, then we can start with the PC part. We need to download two packages from the Windows website so here is the url it's dev.windows.com slash your language and connect slash tools so the first one is the connect for windows sdk this one let us to get the drivers for the connect so this way when your connect is connected with your pc it will be recognized the second one is the Unity Pro package. When you scroll down to the page, you will see this link. Save these files as well. I just unzipped the file we got from the Microsoft Windows website. In this folder, there are three Unity packages and two examples for the connect. Just open the README files. It tells us we need to import the first Unity package and then we can just run the examples. However, the examples are outdated. We actually need to import all the assets manually as well. Here I have a brand new Unity project with a brand new scene. We just need to import the first custom package. Just click asset, click import package, choose custom packages, choose the first one and then click open. Then import all the assets here. And the next one, we need to go to one of the example. The first one we're going to try is the connect view. Just select all the files and drag and drop to the assets folder. Here, Unity give us a warning because all the code are old. We just need to update them. Just click I made backup. Go ahead. This will just take a few seconds. Here you see the main scene is added click on the main scene just make sure your connect is connected to your computer and the power is connected as well just click play you can see me from the connect view it has a little bit depth 
you can see this as well. Hope your example works as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and this tutorial made your life a little bit easier when you try to set up connect with your new project on PC and looking forward to see anything you come up with. You can find me on Twitter at M-A-C-Y-K-U-A-N-G and also you can find me on Google Plus at M-A-C-Y-K-U-A-N-G as well or you can just follow our code to create official social networks and you can ask us any question there and anything you're interested in or you would like to see in the future. Bye for now! So this is what my Viewmaster looked like when it came in the mail. It's a pretty big box. It's like size small, both with my hand. And uh, actually it aims for kids at age 7 and plus. So I think